this particular patient here, her name's Jean, she um, has full benefits at the VA, which is a government-run medical system. She came into my office with classic symptoms of a brain tumor. Just straight out of the textbook, medical student would have said, this lady's got a brain tumor. Call the VA, get her set up. They said, that's fine, she has to see a neurologist first. We can't do an MRI of her brain until she sees a neurologist. Okay, that's fine, we'll do it. How long is that going to be? Three months. Well, the average survival time for somebody who has metastatic brain tumors is three months. When I mentioned that to the VA, they said, well, what do you want us to do about it? That is extremely cost effective. The way that medical entity is run is extremely cost effective. It saves a lot of money. That's not what we did. We got an MRI. She paid cash for it. We cut a deal with the people who run the imaging center, paid 250 bucks for it, got it, got her cancer treatment, and it's five years later and she's doing great. So, you know, she got to see it. She's seen two grandkids be born. She's one of her um, granddaughters is going to the national, junior national Olympics in shooting, and she wouldn't have been able to see any of that. 